Hello everyone, long time no see. Today, I have quite a fun idea. An idea that was also rooted in someone else's previous comment when I think they had mentioned for me to make uh, a bad ranger build, or at least a, a strange crazy ranger build. And I, I guess I'm trying, so I have a build and it's with Druid, so. We'll slide right into the video and we'll, we'll see how it goes and just kind of mess around in this experimental lab that I have in my mind with builds. So let's get started. Hello, okay, so welcome. We are over in the game and we now get to explore this little build. I honestly just, I wanted to go with some form of druid because I haven't actually used druid in quite a while. And in particular, this druid build isn't going to be a support. It's gonna be a bit more of a brawler, a little bit more of some damage, a little bit more of some interrupts and knockbacks and all that stuff, uh, while maintaining a sense of bruisery, playstyle, toe-to-toe, -to -toe, et cetera, et cetera, nouns, verbs, all that. So let's look at the equipment. For the PvP, I'm taking Valkyrie Amulet, Power, Vitality, and Ferocity. The Vitality boost is actually really wonderful. I'm taking Rune of Ranger. And then for my weapons, I'm taking a Great Sword and a Longbow with Sigil of Escape, Sigil of Energy, Sigil of Revocation, and Sigil of Purging. So a little more bruisery playstyle. So with that stat setup, I kind of went in this direction with the build. So I'm taking Skirmishing, Wilderness Survival, and a the Mm, lovely, lovely druid. So for skirmishing, I'm taking primal reflexes. When you successfully evade an attack, gain vigor. It allows you to evade more, of course. Spotter, you increase the precision of nearby allies. The other two really, you know, I mean, I guess you could actually take hidden barbs. Uh, because we a barb out here. Put them in a dungeon under under, if you know what I mean. Uh, because we are taking ancient seeds. Spoiler alert. So actually... Maybe I wanted, maybe I do want to try this, but Spotter does allow you to maybe get a little bit more crits off and also be a bit more of a team player. So I think for the sake of this game that we're going to do, we're going to do Spotter. And then finally, Vicious Quarry. Wilderness Survival, I've decided to take Lesser Muddy Terrain. Oh, well, it, the trait's called Child of Earth, but when you use a healing skill, you allow a little defensive area to pop up. And the next, Shared Anguish, Incoming Disables are transferred to your pet instead. This is a 300 second cooldown, so you really only get one or two uses out of this. Uh, well, maybe like three or four, I don't know, How, however long the game lasts. Um, other ones, you get, maybe, but they're more condition focused. And then finally for this, Wilderness Knowledge. Survival skills gain reduced recharge, grant fury, and remove conditions. We here in the Druid. So for Druid, I've decided to take Druidic Clarity. Becoming a Celestial Avatar removes conditions from you. Extra little, you know, help in that department. Uh, cultivated Synergy could work as well, just to splash some extra heals out. Uh, but next I'm taking Natural Stride. Reduces duration of movement impairing conditions. Your movement speed is increased as long as you have none of these conditions. Overall, it helps with you know, not being locked down for too long. And then finally, Ancient Seeds. Striking a stun, dazed, knocked down, or launched foe. Summons roots to entangle them. Extra damage is wonderful, the bleeding is nice, and also that Amobe. The Amobe, you can't beat it. It's painful to play against and honestly fun to play with. So let's, let's get up here in this match. Let's get up here in this gig. Love to see it. I voted for Forest of Niffle Hell and look what we got. Forest of Niffle Hell. Yeah, I'd say overall for this playstyle. Oh my god, I didn't go over my utilities. Wow, that's so unprofessional of me. So I'm taking Troll Ungent. Uh, you know, a nice healing per second. And conditions removed. I'm taking Glyph of Tides for a knockback. And I'm also taking Glyph of Equality for a daze. And it also serves as my stun break. And then I'm also taking another Muddy Terrain. I know. I know, I'm petty like that, but you know what? It's PVP, you deserve it. And then finally, I'm taking Strength of the Pack. It's a command skill. You gain fury, stability, and swiftness. And then you and your pet also grant might to each other when you attack them. Oh gosh, not the Guardians. 
Uh, I wasn't able to root him. Oh, the block. Okay, I gotta, I gotta troll Unjin. Because I'm starting to take damage. So we gotta, gotta make sure that we're... Ooh, actually. Okay, that's a lot of conditions. Um, I'm gonna just... I'm gonna back off for a little bit. We're gonna... We're gonna fly over here for a bit, because I am taking quite a bit of damage. Troll Engine is nice to trigger early, um, but you have to be aware if you especially if you get low health, it's kind of difficult because you have to also consider the um, the actual time it takes for the healing to process. So you- How to block? Ugh. Invulnerable! Okay, well. You know what, that's embarrassing and I'll probably edit that out, but I literally was unable to even kill this guardian. And I, you know what, guardians, okay, I'm a guardian main, arena net, you guys need to do something about guardians. Like, they're, it, yeah, it's, it's a problem. At this point, it's a problem and there needs to be a solution. Um, I actually don't know what else to do. This match seems like... Did we get a really bad match to start off with? That's so upsetting. That's so upsetting. Well, everyone, this match is certainly one for the books. <laughs> okay, wonderful. We got that one over with. Okay, that was what well, you know what that was a warm-up we've warmed up now we need to cool down and you guardian and weaver i guess we're gonna go and head to mid first um no one's going home actually so i'm gonna go do that um because i'm a team player not this right not this not this how are you immune oh my gosh how are you all immune I, I need to take this up with HR. Um, we have some things to get rid of here. Okay, you know what? You know what? It seems that I've made a grave mistake. So I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just like not do this. Okay, 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 okay. Um, I'm, oh my God, I'm up, I'm up, I'm up, okay. <laughs> Oh god, I gotta heal. I'm healing. I got the stealth. I healed. We're great. How did he fuck me? Get away from me. Get away. Get, get. Interrupted. Yeah, get interrupted. Yeah. Uh, uh. Stop it. Stop. Stop. Drop and roll. There we go. Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna just focus on this a little bit. Okay. Get some more vulnerability on him. Wonderful. Love to see it. Love to see it. I actually am going to go in Celestial Avatar. This might help, actually. This might actually really be useful now. Celestial Avatar can be very nice in PvP, but it feels sometimes like very difficult to get into. Time to pew pew from afar. And this is when you really know that you are the best. This is when you get to realize that, you know, you've made good choices in life. Oh, how was that? That was one long in, in vault. Okay. Hello. Get away. Get. <laughs> okay, that's a lot of damage. That is quite a bit of damage. I see. I see now that, um, you know, damage has been dealt. Ooh. Okay, wrong, wrong, wrong place to be. Wrong place to be at the wrong time. Um, I'm gonna actually switch to my longbow and not on my watch. Not on my watch. Oh yeah, three people here. This is, it's game time now. It's game time. It's, it quite, it's quite literally game time. Oh gosh, that was a, that was a spicy emote. I'm gonna, Okay, the thing, the thing with stealth is that you stealth and you instantly get out of stealth. And it's a little infuriating. It's not gonna lie. Block it. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. This is weird. This is weird. 
this is a bit strange. This is a little strange. This is a little worrying and upsetting. If you know what I mean. It's There's so many AoEs. There's quite literally so many AoEs that I don't know what to do. Um, you know what I am going to do? I'm actually going to run. Okay, the fact that it shot me back. No. So, no. He just beat me. He me for me. I will stop. Okay, why are you following? Get away. I'm going to go this way. Um... Um, I'm gonna just, just gonna make sure. Okay, we need to regroup because they, they do have quite a foothold on, um, R. Did no one, no one wanted to get home. No one, no one was like, maybe we should go get, or no, no one wanted to get far. Like, they were over there and they were just like, no. And then go, come on, come on, activate it, activate it. Never mind, they died. <laughs> It's still, it's, it's giving, it's giving, um, it's giving, I'm desperate to at least neutralize this point. You know what I mean? <laughs> oh, oh, did someone healing sign at me? Okay. I, I saw death. I saw death flash. Okay. Oh, that was very sad. Got us. Get him out. Get him out. You, you know it, you know it, bro. Get him out. You don't. Attack. Our lord's under attack. Are you kidding me? You really gonna? You really gonna do that now? Hmm. Really? Serious? Get away. Your lord is under attack. Get. Get. Get interrupted. Get. Because we have far, and we're very close. We got a, we got a kill. That's fun. Wait. Get away. You mean to tell me that my um. No, you know what? We're not gonna. <laughs> Gosh. Okay. Okay. How did I miss both of those? Ooh. Okay. You know what? I do have to. I am gonna get off the point and then move him. And then come over here. Great. Okay. You know what? We might have been able to clutch that just a just a bit. That was obstructed. Get away. Ooh. Oh, okay. Sorry. Sorry. I might have messed up. My apologies. How are you gonna block all that? Really? You really gonna do this like that? Okay. I got some vulnerability on. Okay. It's not gonna work. He already is at max health. Okay. Hollow Smith. See, that's what I don't understand about the build design and the, the balance is like, we're going to make a class that can literally do everything. Like, you know, long gone are the days of someone specializing into something or there being counters to things. It's like, no, I can, I can control you. I can DPS you. I can afflict you with every Connie to make your life a living hell. I can heal myself instantly and then also give myself every boon of the game. So at this point, at this point, it is what it is. I need to outlive this. Ooh. Yes. Okay, we won. We won. We played our role of disrupting and not being able to do damage. Love to see it. Big defense. Big defense vibes. Right, everyone. Thank you so, so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. This was a very fun, interrupty, bruisery, bunker, druid video. Hope you guys enjoy. If you guys would like to help support the channel, I have a Patreon. Now that I'm in summer vacation and I have a little bit of time off from all the academic stress, I will be posting more videos. So thank you everyone so much for coming by. Subscribe, like, all that stuff. Yeah, comment, yeah, all, all that stuff, you know. I'll see you guys in the next one. So great to be back. And, uh, yeah. Bye, everyone. Mwah.